numerous initiatives by local and state uh, governments in India from uh, data management systems to verifiable certificate issuances currently use blockchain technology. Uh, ever since Bitcoin popularized blockchain technology worldwide, the tech has found its way into myriad processes from finance to public administration. What started as a flex statement for early adopters has now become a way of revamping legacy systems and improving immutability, uh, you know, transparency and decentralization. But despite its proven real world use cases, most government agencies continue to take a cautious approach to adopting and infusing blockchain into their paper-based processes, uh, given its predominant link uh, to the cryptocurrency uh, ecosystem. However, a change of heart is underway as emerging economies see blockchain as a rare opportunity to establish a trust-based system for society. While still reluctant to legitimize cryptocurrencies fully, India has generally accepted blockchain technology. Numerous initiatives by local and state governments in India, ranging from data management systems to verifiable certificate issuances, uh, currently use blockchain technology at their core. And his expedited blockchain adoption is supported by an active developer and startup community, which builds custom solutions to tackle specific use cases. Uh, Cointelegraph's pursuit to uh, uh, decipher India's affinity for blockchain uh, led to a conversation with uh, anchor Rocky Sinha, uh, the co-founder and CEO of AirChains, a Web3 startup focused on a middleware software um, uh, uh, as a service platform. Um, I'm speaking of Cointelegraph, Ankur explained India's massive appetite for blockchain and how elected leaders have been driving the change. So, uh, many driver what's going on in the 2027 what has a number with each other uh, that, that aren't able to about the face of time and there's a certain face of time that faces uh, and that individuals could be their faces and institutions and in the sender and that that seeing as many other and into many other of uh, incorporating blockchain technology uh, it addresses various challenges at different levels uh, such as enhancing transparency uh, traceability and establishing trust and these factors contribute to the growing interest and widespread adoption of blockchain within India. India is one of the fastest growing blockchain markets globally uh, with over 56 percent of Indian businesses reporting an inclination toward adopting blockchain technology uh, with a developer base of a whopping of 10 billion. Uh, the Indian talent pool has been recognized uh, globally by leading Web3 firms uh, with the aim of fostering Web3 innovation and growth. Uh, um, in, in your discussions with the government agencies, um, are there any talks of crypto adoption? Uh, currently, regulatory clearances surrounding cryptocurrency adoption are still uncertain. However, government agencies are actively exploring various avenues and seeking improved regulations. They're open to the idea and are diligently working toward creating a conducive environment for cryptocurrency adoption. Uh, can you share any data and or use cases that show improvements from older systems? Uh, yes, our recent collaboration with the Newtown Kolkata Development Authority showcases the real-life adoption of blockchain with a vast expanse of 27,000 acres of land and its staggering 50,000 NFTs representing 1 million ownerships. The NKD's adoption of NFTs for land mutation, the transfer of property titles, has revolutionized the traditional approach and the initiatives demonstrate the growing recognition and commitment harnessing the potential of blockchain to drive innovation and efficiency across various sectors. Uh, is India betting big uh, on blockchain? Are there any government initiatives that help drive this cause? And they are. Yes, India is definitely betting big on blockchain. Uh, various government agencies and bodies within India are actively seeking to collaborate with blockchain solutions while there's yet to be a high-level blockchain initiative uh, from the government of India. Thus far, there's a strong demand from uh, government uh, entities that AirChains is actively addressing. One of the profound use cases of blockchain adoption into the remarkable first-ever NFT-based uh, uh, land mutation uh, in India. 
Additionally, in January 2020, Niti Ayo's two-part report titled Blockchain, the India strategy made it apparent that while regulations regarding cryptocurrencies and other digital assets are under consideration, government is significantly aware of the promise of core blockchain technology to transform various systems. Um, several Indian government bodies are supportive of blockchain technology adoption and have collaborated with air chains to incorporate novel blockchain-based systems ensuring accountability and security. Um, the Regar District Authority has collaborated with us uh, to create a blockchain-based tree plantation monitoring system for the betterment of CSR initiatives, um, whereas the Firas Abbott Police Department worked with us to create a blockchain complaint management system to prevent tampering of reports. Uh, uh, and then a bill, and not usually, uh, it, it creates uh, just um, Indian government agencies, um, state governments, uh, and bureaucrats possess a profound understanding of blockchain and web free technologies. Uh, they are well versed in the, in the latest developments and trends within the blockchains uh, space, including liquidity, private chains, and zero knowledge roll ups. Uh, their comprehension of blockchain extends beyond surface level knowledge, uh, as many officials have in depth insights into how the technology functions. Uh, while some officials contemplate how uh, blockchain should ideally operate, uh, others are actively exploring ways uh, to leverage this technology to address uh, the unique challenges. And so, you know, what's the role of blockchain in India's overall growth and, and you know, uh, to be available disease. Uh, uh, take last said new seeds and then end February summer uh, four away from possible disease put the Ford district uh, with lower stops and physical jobs with owners point said uh, this same time developers enterprises and institutional use cases emerging in India underscores the significant growth potential of blockchain in the country. As blockchain adoption continues to expand it is expected drive innovation foster economic development and create new opportunities across various sectors. Another key push to India's growth has been the entry of various global web free players into the Indian developer market. Um, India is home to 450 uh, plus web three startups uh, and has received over $1.5 billion uh, in investments between 2021 and 2022 according to a 2022 a uh, mask on Indian uh, uh, Web3 landscape analysis report. Additionally, the report also highlighted um, that 11% of global Web3 talent is in India, making it third worldwide. Uh, blockchain in India has the potential to contribute significantly due to with the vast developer talent and the active Web3 community present in the country. Uh, we've seen numerous instances of statewide blockchain implementations over the past three years. Um, are there any nationwide implementations of blockchain uh, in India or any such plans for the future um, on what's in system? And that's what uh, highly be made today uh, for consistence uh, uh, for cameras on manufacturers and the National Payments Corporation of India uh, to unified payments interface or exploring uh, the potential of blockchain technology and conducting tests. Public sector banks are also uh, actively experimenting with blockchain to determine uh, how they can harness its uh, capabilities. These initiatives indicate a strong likelihood of nationwide blockchain use cases emerging in the near future. AirChains recently executed a statewide use case with NKDA, and we are currently excited working on multiple state level use cases that have the potential to impact the nation as a whole. How do you convince a government body to accept a new system? And, and as government bodies are actively interested in adopting blockchain solutions to address their specific challenges. However, they emphasize the importance of operating within regulatory frameworks, demonstrating transparency, efficiency, and improved outcomes is key to gaining government support in the development journey. Uh, which countries are ahead of India when it comes to wide-scale blockchain adoption? What measures must a country take to expedite blockchain adoption? Um, there are several countries in Central America that are actively pursuing wide-scale blockchain adoption within their ecosystems. India, being a large nation, 
is activists striving to accelerate the adoption of blockchain technology for numerous use cases. The country has established itself as a center of excellence in blockchain, with multiple agencies exploring various applications. Uh, to expedite progress, implementing clear regulations is, is crucial. Uh, this includes defining guidelines for blockchain implementation and determining permissible use cases which will facilitate faster execution and broader adoption. Um, can homegrown blockchain technology be used in offshore use cases? Many projects are originating from India, such as Polygon, and various layer one and layer two solutions have gained global recognition. AirChains has also successfully collaborated with government agencies globally in Central America and Europe. Currently, there are several offshore projects in the pipeline for AirChains, scheduled to be completed within the next six to seven months. Utilizing homegrown blockchain technology for offshore use cases is indeed a goal being pursued. Um, of the problem, similar said, uh, we know we're struggling in the planets now, but happening and they put happen in sometimes they don't and investors primarily seek scalability and feasibility in blockchain adoption among other key factors funding in the blockchain space typically involves investors who believe in the potential of the technology and its ability to bring about transformative changes uh, what is your advice to fellow blockchain uh, entrepreneurs in India and in this case of my advice is the computer shock is involving a wide range of use cases and, and driving blockchain adoption of a higher scale. But, but by creating innovative solutions and demonstrating the real world benefits of blockchain technology, we can accelerate its adoption and drive positive change in various industries.